All right, and now we're going to curve. Hey, Mike, good to see you. Good to see you, Terry. Nice to see you again. All right, we're all familiar with how potholes can wreck your car suspension, but those aren't the only kinds of hazards drivers need to worry about. Attorney Mike Schaefer has written several books about the damage a couple of wrong turns can make to your finances. So we'll start right here. What kind of questions do people have after they're involved in an auto accident, Mike? Well, Terry, when somebody's been in a car accident, their main concerns are, can I go to the doctor? Am I a lot, how are my medical bills going to get paid? Uh, am I going to get paid for the time I'm missing work so I can keep my bills uh, up to date while I'm going through my treatment and recovery? And those are the main concerns at that point in time. They're not really concerned about compensation and what can happen down the road as far as with the insurance company and being compensated for their pain and suffering. They want, they want their family taken care of at that all point. Right, all right, let's talk about the potholes that you reference in this book here. What are these seven potholes? Well, Potholes are the mistakes people make, and one of the things, the first thing is right at the time of the accident, documenting the scene, taking pictures with your cell phone, uh, not going to the doctor right away. Even if you don't think you're hurt, you should go to the doctor to make sure because one of the things insurance companies will say, if there's a delay in treatment, if you're really hurt so bad from this accident, why didn't you go to the doctor at that mm -hmm. point in time? And there's several others, hiring the wrong attorney, not documenting what you do as you uh, go through the case, giving a statement to the insurance company without talking to a lawyer and not being prepared for it. That's just, the insurance company wants to take your statement immediately, right. and that's not absolutely necessary. There's no time frame on it. And they take statements every day, just like you interview people every day. Right. You'd be much better at it than most people, John Doe, down on the street. And an insurance company just kind of wants to get this thing. Let's close this deal here and then let's sign here. Well, don't sign anything. Don't sign a thing. They, they want to save as much money as possible. Your job is to protect your family and make sure your family is taken care of in the, this Indeed. case. And if I can jump back to the medical for just a minute or two. Sometimes you may not know that you have been injured. It may take a little time for it to actually show itself, a slip disc or something. That's correct. And that's one of the reasons that you should go to the doctor immediately to check out. A lot of time the doctor can see the injury even though you're not in pain at that point in time. So it's just a matter of being checked out to make sure that you're not injured or that you are injured so that it's documented down the road. Take right, that argument away from the insurance company. Indeed, and they're good at arguing back. Amen. Amen there. <laughs> That's the business they're in. All right, let's talk about protective measures you can take before you are in an accident. The main thing you can do right now, if out on the road, I see people come in almost every week where the insurance from the car that hit them is the, the state minimum lim limits, which is $25,000 or they're an uninsured vehicle. What most insurance agents don't tell their uh, clients is uh, you can get uninsured motorist coverage and underinsured motorist coverage. You should have as much coverage for that as, as you can afford that can protect your family. And it's very cheap coverage. You might be able to get $250,000 of coverage for 30, 40 bucks every six months. So that's one of the things I urge people to do is to call their insurance agent see what their coverage is, and make sure that they have uninsured, underinsured coverage, and ask how much it will cost to increase the limits. I tell in my first book the, what you don't know about buying car insurance can hurt you uh, about my brother-in-law reading the, uh, the, the rough draft of the book. He took that, called his insurance agent, got five times the coverage, and saved himself $200 every six months. Now, can I promise that's going to happen for you? Right. No, but you're not going to know unless you ask your insurance agent, and then you protect your family. All right. Appreciate your time, Mike. And really, rule Thanks number one me. is make sure you document when something happens. Document. You, you got document. your smartphone with you. By Amen. the way, if you're a licensed Kentucky driver, you can get a free copy of any of Mike Schaefer's books by calling 584-9511. Go online to KentuckyAccidentBooks.com. Thanks, Mike. Thanks.